Assalamu alaikum, how are you? My dear students, uh, today we are going to uh, explain lesson 27 graph and represent inequalities. In this lesson, our objective will be how to graph and represent inequalities, and uh, we need to focus on the steps of uh, graphing inequality and the steps of representing inequality. Here we start. Let's have this example. X is greater than or equal 5. How I graph this inequality? I have three steps. The first step, I draw the number line. Here, I put 5, 6, 7, 8. For example, I put some values less than 5, like 3, 4, 2, and so on. Here, as you can see, the inequality is x greater than or equal 5. So I start by 5. I draw a circle at 5. And because x is greater than or equal 5, in this case, I shade the circle, which means that 5 can be a solution for this inequality. Now I start, uh, I choose some points or some values which can be solution. X greater than or equal 5, this means 6 can be a solution. 8 can be a solution. Then I shade these values here and draw an arrow to show that this values go forever by this I have graphed this inequality now if I have inequality graphed how I represent it look at this graph here we put 13 14 15, 16, here we put 12, 11, and 10. This inequality graphed in this form. And it's open circle. Here, I choose any variable. Let's say x. And where's the starting point is 13 so I put 13 now I need to put symbol here to represent the inequality because the graph go left and it's on the value which is less than 13 so I put less than but do I need to put equal or no because the circle look the circle is open so this means is 13 is not solution so x represent all the values less than 13. Another example, if you have this graph for inequality, let me change the color. It's shaded circle, by the way. Here, I choose any variable, let's choose x. Here the starting point is 4. So what the symbol I need to write here to represent the inequality? Because the arrow go left, this means this represents the values less than 4. But because 4 can be a solution, so and the circle is shaded, I put equal. This means x represent all the values less than or equal 4. By this, we come to the end of this session. Thank you very much.